And today I'm going to show you how you can very quickly and very cheaply check the coil on your small engine. Basically, this is your small engine coil. If you don't have spark coming from this coil, your motor is not going to run. You have two wires here. And if you can see them, that come down and go to the coil itself. One of these is your ground wire, and the other one is the key switch wire. Now, if you shouldn't have any spark on your motor when you turn it over, okay, you can test this, you can hold it with a screwdriver, but basically, if you just put the ground wire there, and you ground it someplace on the motor, and you turn it over, you should have spark. Okay. As you can see, we have no spark at all on that plug. So what we want to do next is we want to unplug the kill switch wire from the coil to see if we have any spark at all. And if we do have spark, what that tells us is that there's a problem in the wiring, okay? And you're going to want to trace this wiring from the ground all the way back and maybe even replace your kill switch because your kill switch could be the issue, could be just shorting out. All right, we still have no spark. Now that tells me that probably this coil is bad. Okay, so there you have it, a quick, easy, effective way to check your coil on your small engine. Just remember the few basic things that I told you. The coil must be grounded, okay? And there must not be a short between the input wire, uh, which comes from uh, generating spark from your flywheel, there must not be any shorts between this wire, the switch, and back to ground. 